Hi guys, it's Lisa. How are you doing today? I'm doing well. I'm coming to you today with a little something different from me than, than I normally do. I'm going to be reviewing some makeup brushes. And a company reached out to me actually, which was okay, a surprise, but a pleasant surprise, and asked me if I would be interested in doing a review on a couple of their products. So they sent me a list. I said, of course, and you know, figured out all the details, whatever. And um, I got to choose two products and I chose makeup brushes and I chose also um, a Samsung tablet cover. But this review is going to be on the makeup brushes. So the name of the company, I have it right here. So I would not forget or mess it up. And as it is, I may have to put the name here. But it's called... Okay, sorry about that. The name of the company is... Well, this person is a member of the company, so she sent me the message. And she says she's a member of Seller Marketing of... It's Y-D-Y-A-K-E. And it's a leading international e-commerce marketplace based in China. So basically, like I said, I had to choose a couple of items and then we worked out something with PayPal and I actually had to get it, buy it from Amazon, but they sent me what I needed to get what I needed. So it was no expense to me. And um, anyway, I got my product. So I'm going to just show you the makeup brushes, like I said. It came in a regular yellow envelope and it came back with like this and like that. Now when I went to the site on Amazon, they had two different colors, but the color that the girl sent me a link of was the bamboo one, so that's what I got. They have a, a pink colored one set also and that one was like, um, I think $2 less than this one. This set was $12.99, if I'm not mistaken. $12.99 with free shipping. So these are the brushes. It's seven of them. And I thought this was really nice the way they had them packaged in this little net like. This one, see how pretty it is? This one I think is, um, I guess you can use it for what you want to use it for, but if anything, I would use it probably for like powder or for, not for blush. That's just me. I don't really use brushes like that, but, and then here's another one. This one I think is a powder brush. It's really, really fluffy. It feels really nice. So that's that one. This one looks like it's a lip brush. They're very nice. They got a little bit of weight to them. They feel really good quality. This one I'm thinking is a eyeshadow brush or whatever kind of brush you want to use it for. Really nice. This one, I guess it's um, on there to keep the shape, I'm thinking. So this one is like an angle blush brush. I would probably I'd use this one for powder. Or you can use it for blush, whatever you want to use it for. Okay, and here's another one. This one looks like an eyeshadow brush also. And looks like it's two eyeshadow brushes. So I think this is very, very nice. So this is what I received. I'm going to tell you a little bit about what they're saying about these brushes. Okay. It's saying that it's super dense. Well, they're talking about each brush. Super dense powder brush. The diameter of the powder brush hair is about five centimeters the height is five centimeters really thick soft perfect for the professional and beginners so that's this one it says super soft bristles which is very very true made of premium 
synthetic fiber, soft for touch, never hurts your skin, no shedding, no fading, absorb less liquids and creams, easy to pick up powder. And then it also says walnut wooden handle, timeless, timeless use with brown cone shaped fancy look, supply comfortable feeling, no slippery, no distortion, no fading, no cracking, no shrinkage. So it's saying that this brush is not supposed to do any of that. So, okay. And basically that's all it's talking about. But from what I can see so far, the brushes are really nice. And like I said, they're really sturdy. And you know, I like to pull on them just to see. And there aren't any bristles coming out. So I'm going to use these. I may or may not do it on camera. I use some of these because you guys know, you already know how I am. And see, it feels really nice. So I shall be back. Okay guys, so I am back and I did use the brushes. I used foundation, which I used Fenty Beauty. It was the color 400. And I think it's a little too light for me, but you know, it kind of, I know I suppose to what you say, oxidized or something, it gets a little darker. So anyway, I'm going to show you what I used. I used the Sleek Makeup, like a highlighter, because I don't really do blush. I used my Soft Glam Palette. You guys already know this is my favorite. I used that. I put my foundation on with the foundation brush, which I usually like to use my fingers whenever I wear it, which I don't wear it that often. I use these four brushes, of the brushes that I had to review, and I have to admit I do like them. You know, I really don't use brushes that often, but if I have to use brushes, I would. These would be the brushes that I use because I love I love them. Really nice and soft. Um, still no bristles missing. I love them. I love the way they came packaged. They um they came in a little pouch. Here it is. So, I think I showed you guys this little pouch. But I won't be storing them in that. I'm going to store them up here with the rest of my brushes. brushes. But I have to admit, out of the brushes that I have, these are my favorite ones so far. So, back to the makeup. I use the Extra Super Lash by Rimmel. And I do like it. Still not my favorite, but I do like it. I use the Estee Lauder Double Wear something eyeliner. Stay in place eye pencil. And Onyx. That's a little one. Came in a little Okay. Came in a little kit that I had. And I use my Smashbox powder it's in it's in dark halo this is what it looks like on the back it's like on the front okay and the lipstick I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills this is a metallic liquid lipstick set this is what the box looks like this is what the colors look like. I use this color, this one, and this one is called Mai Tai. Mai Tai. I think that's what this is. And I'm actually going to use this other one. It's called Blizzard. That made me dizzy. It's called Blizzard, which is this one. Okay, if I can get it out. This one. And it dries, even though it doesn't say it's matte, it feels like it's a little bit matte. It feels matte, but then it feels soft at the same time. So I'm going to try a little bit of this. And since I'm keeping this, 
And I just kind of, it's like a, a iridescent pearl like color with sparkles. Look at that. I think it's pretty, although it looks kind of like powdered donuts on here, but it's actually pretty. So. Here is my makeup. So that's that guys, but I'm gonna put the information for these brushes down below. And I wanna thank Brittany for sending them to me in your company, cause I actually really, really love them. And yeah, that's about it. So guys, stay tuned for my next review. I will be back soon. So thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Take care. Be good. Try to be good. But if you can't be good, be good at it. Do we?